From the late 50s, when we first started to use synthetic materials in fishing tools, hundreds upon thousands of kilometers of nets have been used in the Baltic Sea. Many of those nets were lost. A ghost net is a, a, a net lost by the fisherman. We wondered if they were still fishing and if so, to what extent? That was what we tried to find out. After two years or so, so fung and food far and so there are mellan eight, nine, ten percent of the som torskan and all runt on kring jorda. Framför allt är det väldigt oetiskt att djurplockeri utan lekar vad det är och väldigt lite uppmärksamma. With his crew, underwater filmmaker Joachim Odelberg set out to find the answers. Yeah, four or five minutes. We travelled through countries around the Baltic Sea, meeting scientists, politicians, fishermen and researchers to understand their views on ghost nets. And here is where our journey begins. Det är att stänga in de här och de hittar inte ut och så blir det då att de äter på varandra och allt det. 